Welcome back, one and all, to Baldur's Gate 3. We are in the midst of the Goblin Citadel, having conversed recently with the chief of the goblins, Dror Ragslin, in the uh, throne room over here. He has instructed us to interview these prisoners. And while uh, we have freed our uh, friend, the bard, Volo, there is this very strange ritual that we happen to stumble upon. And uh, we're going to do a little bit of, inv of investigation because this seems too interesting to pass up. Well, first of all, can we read this? Diagrams of bodies twisted into impossible shapes cover the pages while handwritten notes fill the margins. Be wary of your mortal limitations. While it is tempting to allow pain's ecstasies to sweep you away, particularly during a delicious bout of self-flagellation. Broken bones hinder worship of our maiden of pain. Instead, when the body is spent, focus on a whipping or perhaps nail removal. Pliers or blade is recommended to ensure Leviathar may forever revel in your agony, as is her right. Well, um... A being who is worshipped through the self-infliction of pain? Not on my list of deities I'd want to worship, but let's check in with this guy. Why don't we? Greetings, child. I've met few aside from goblins here. You recognize the Scourge. This man is a follower of Leviathar, goddess of pain. Ah, are you also here to assist with the prisoner? Um, I'm not a torturer, if that's what you mean, but tell me more. I was invited to teach them some of my techniques. I live for pain and its intricacies, you see. But, alas, these goblins seem to thrive on the crude and primitive. Pain without purpose is a terrible thing. Wouldn't you agree? Well, uh, yeah, I thought a follower of Levi Leviatar would approve of pain. The purpose is interrogation, right? You know the Maiden of Pain. How refreshing. But there is more to us than that. Yes, we worship her through pain, often our own, but it is an intimate and loving thing, one we offer up. If you would permit it, I can show you firsthand. Oh my. Uh, I don't... Your hide, your choice. Not quite my cup of tea, though. Uh... So what exactly are you offering? She does strike me as an evil goddess. Let me try some of those techniques. That seems bad. I don't, I don't think I... I don't think I want any part of this. Is that a promise? Oh, a pity, though. You would have known such sweet relief at my hands. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should return to my own worship. Yeah, rain check for never, I think. Yikes, what a... What a wild <laughs> conversation to have. Just with some guy. I don't love being offered to participate in whatever that was, but... Anyway. Poor lad. I could give you peace, you know. But no. You gotta keep silent, don't you? Where do they flee to, you stubborn rat? Please, stop! Let's see if maybe we can intervene. Here to see your friend, have ya? Come and join him if you like. Say we'll take over. His work is sloppy. He'll kill the prisoner too quickly. 
That's true. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Let's see. Performance. I've got plus eight two. Yeah, we'll say exactly what Shadowheart <laughs> asked us to say. Uh, we'll take guidance from Shadowheart. DC fifteen. And we got 15 even before all the bonuses. Cool. What? Think you could do better? <laughs> Go on then. How about it? I don't put you on shows for amateurs. Yeah. What? You shy or something? Fine. Muck it up and the draw will have your head. Come on, Crush. There might still be a slurp of ale to be had. I want to watch that weird priest next door. Yeah. Sounded like he was beating something up. Oh, yeah, beating it good. I don't know if you what? want to do that. The oh, we can talk to the rat. Hang on. Oh, forget about it. Rat's nose twitches impatiently. Her teeth bite air as though it is flesh, but it doesn't sate her hunger. Oh, the rat doesn't want to talk. Okay, well, it was worth a try. Or do I have to speak with animals? Yeah, I do. Okay, the rat is just not feeling particularly conversant right now. Anyway. Uh, how do I... Uh, there we go. Please, please. Let me out. There's no reason for this. Uh, I could pick the lock. I'm looking for a druid name of Housen. Let's talk Housen. about that first. I I don't know. He, he, he changed into a bear, but I lost sight of him. I don't know if he's still alive. That's all I know. P please, get me out of here. Okay, and then what about the night song? Somewhere underneath the temple. There's a hidden passage. Oh, under the temple. B Brian had instructions. The temple that we're in right now? The goblins got him. They, they, they said they'd eat him. Please, Brian, please. have we seen him before? The shackles. I, I don't want to die. Yeah, let's. We can Thank get him out. You. Thank you so much. Um, let's see. Sleight of hand. I mean, I guess we'll do it, right? I don't know. I guess we can just say that we're escorting the prisoner. Okay, DC 12 with guidance. All right, so I need a, like a uh, an eight or higher. That's what I'm hoping for. That'll do. The lock clicks and opens. Perfect. Well, first things first, we'll get you a shirt. How about that? Thank you. I, I, I better go before they catch us. I should be able to make it to the grove on my own. They need to know they're in danger. Um, what does the night song do? The goblins probably just wanted him to give up the location. That's not exactly a mystery. I don't know. The boss didn't say... He just said some wizard called Laroa Khan would reward us if we found it. That's all. And the goblins wanted to find the grove, the, right? The grove. Yeah. To the east. They wanted to know where we came from. No. They'll kill everyone. Please. I need to warn them. Yeah, by all means. Is he going to be able to sneak out of here? Oh, look at that. A little side, uh, side entrance over there. Okay. Well, let's see what we got here. First of all, let's pick this up. Uh, and let's check our journal. So that was updated. Housen transformed into a bear during the chaos. He might still be in that shape. 
Uh, let's see. Discover the artifact secrets. Very good. We have what the drow needs in order to order the raid, which we don't want to do. Search for Halzen. So we need to... Yeah, we need to look for a bear, essentially. Um... So, okay, I guess we'll we'll come over here. It's, I mean, I imagine Halzen's not going to be here, but just in case, just in case he is, I'll take that. Thank you very much. Uh, how do we get out of here from here? Where where did our buddy go? All right, hang on. Let's cast light. So we can actually see what's going on here. Um, how the heck did our friend escape? I guess there must be, huh, there must be a way out of here that's not super evident to us. Okay, well, that is fine. I guess we'll just keep looking around here for a bear. Let's take a look at the map. Have we searched every passage yet? Not really, actually. So let's go up and to the right. And at some point, we've got to go down to the basement. From what it sounds like. We'll start off sharp eye Eve. Okay, a bunch of sharp eyes. Whatever that means. Those eyes. Again. Do you wanna become spider food? The foul stench of slaughter turns suddenly sweet through the rat's nose. Blood smell. Life smell. Not like the great hollow below, which smells only of death. Hmm. Can't we just swarm the forest? Drow wants to know Heading exactly. to see our new pet. It didn't seem easy. Oh. I'll give you that. Wouldn't happen to be a bear pet, would it? I'll tell you. The scrying eye was looking at me all strange. Interesting. Right. What would some drow wizard in Moonrise want to look at you for? Unless you're talking about the, uh... Because he a beautiful eye. The rat. What do they need to be looking at any of us for? Is what I'm saying. We're all on the same side. Although like we're gonna set the true soul on fire. They're drow. They're... Let's see. I've got a good feeling about this. Ooh, the warg pens. I mean, that would be a good as place as any to keep a bear, right? You know. Potion of healing. I'm just gonna. I'm going to take this. Yoink. Scroll of protection of good and evil. I'll take that. Yoink. Alright. Anything else? I guess we'll check the broken cabinet real quick. Ooh, there's a lot of good stuff in here. Gold, dark vision. Yeah, I'm going to take all that. For sure. Uh, a couple barrels. Probably not much in their value. I would think. Wooden chest. I will help myself to that. Thank you. A bunch of gold. Wooden crate. Silver trays and plates and such. A mace. I'll pass on that. Um, anything else in here that I'm missing? A bunch of blood on the walls. That's good to see. Alright. I think we're good in here. Let's uh, save while we're at it. Like sure of rock. You like to see the bear? Yeah, Just perfect. War have been going crazy for it. I Just for sure am here to see the bear. Will satisfy the bunch when they're in this state. Prison key. Where was that? Right here. Okay, that would be nice to get. Gypsy one. 
All right, well, let's let's look around the area first. And then we can go from there. All right, there's a lever in there to release the wargs. Three. See? It squealed! <laughs> it's it again! Keep your hands steady, three. Oh, the bear's in there. I see. Stop them! Free me! That's probably Halzen right there, yeah. Again! Again! Make it squeal again! Uh, yeah, what are you doing, kids? The beast came in here with those robbers, killed Dink and Mince too. Boss is thinking of serving it to the wargs. And it makes funny noises. We made it squeal. Look, look, you'll see. Give me that rock. I'll show you. Hmm. I could try this illithid thing. I don't... I haven't used it a whole lot. This wisdom check. I'm not very good at wisdom, so but let's try it. Let's try it for the fun of it. Oh, DC 2. Oh, interesting. Well, we'll take guidance. So as long as we don't get a nat 1. Yeah, good thing it's a low DC. Oh, you're also... Uh, yes, uh, of course. Something stirs deep within you, hungry and alert. It's taking something you'll never get back. Uh-oh. Maybe we don't want to use that too much. But I want to hear it squeal. One, that's a true soul you're talking to. Show some respect. Sorry, Mum. I'll open the cage for you. Cool. Thank you. It's nice when this whole illithid, illithid thing actually now pays off. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on. Hold on. Um... Attack the goblins. I guess we attack the goblins. Time for blood. That's not how I thought this would turn out. Oh boy. So this is how it goes, huh? Whoa, Beastmaster Zerk. Okay. Oh boy, this is not how I hoped this would uh, go. But we're in it now. We're in the thick of it. So... Oh, I don't, I don't want to kill the kid. I'm going to... I'm gonna. Ah, that's the worst. I wish there was a way to do non-lethal damage to him. Just to knock him out so he wouldn't go upstairs. I guess we could t always teleport over there and do non-lethal damage, but... Ah, still feel bad about it. Brawler Burka is level 1. Beastmaster Zerk. Butcher Vrak. Okay. 3 is right behind us as well. Okay. So what's the plan here? I've still got Guidance on me. Shielded. Okay. Cool. Just making sure I understand what's going on here. We... I wonder if this conjured spider would go away if I can break this, uh, this guy's concentration. He's got concentration on Hunter's Mark, so no, I guess not. He, this is probably just independently summoned. So what spells do I have? A Vicious Mockery. Let's do that. Let's start off with that. Vicious Mockery on the spider. Away, I Ooh, um, no, let's, let's save our Bardics for now. Okay, that's a shame. But let's go up top here to get a little bit of range. Okay, very interesting. And that'll be that. They're gonna the kid's gonna disengage and run away. That's fine. I could use cutting words. I'm not gonna react. I don't think it's gonna be that much damage. Yeah. Oh, where'd this guy come from? Oh, he was on a patrol, I guess. Alright, Shadowheart. I guess let's go ahead and take a Brawler Burka. Um, 
or the spider. Let's see, sacred flame, 45%. That's not amazing. 16%, not amazing. Guiding bolt. We're using our mace now, right? Man, okay, so what, what are our relative damage amounts? Two to nine damage from a main hand attack or one to eight. So it's better just to hit it. So let's let's just do that. Yeah, we'll use our reaction to do one damage. Cool. Uh, we'll go ahead and summon a spiritual weapon, I guess. We'll do the... Um, Great Sword, Halberd, Maul, Spear, Trident. I mean, the Great Axe is, looks really cool. So let's do it right here so we can keep chopping away at the spider, is what I'm thinking. And we'll stay right where we are. Ooh, they're going to try to get through the gate. Yikes. Okay. Alright, the spider. Spider gonna get an opportunity attack on them. Oh, he's actually gonna retreat, briefly, which is unexpected. All right, at least we have an ally. Cool. I've got a couple turns happening simultaneously. Spiritual weapon. Probably just gonna come over here and attack the spider. Oh damn. Okay. That's it for the spiritual weapon. Gale. I could magic missile. I only need two. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do a basic magic missile. Level one. So we'll do one. And then... Anybody have concentration right now? That's the kid there. This guy has concentration. So he's going to have to roll two, two checks. Uh, good. He failed a saving throw. Awesome. And then Gale. Let's pull... Let's see, the warrior's coming from this way, right? Let's pull him back slightly, just to, so that we've got our melee folks up front. Bonus action. I don't think there's anything I need him to do right now. So, in turn, and then Lazel is just going to come up and um, pushing attack melee. Yeah, let's do that. Whoa, 19 damage. Holy cow, Lazel. Uh, I could do second wind. It's once a short rest just to get it down for sure if I wanted to, and... Or not second wind, uh, action surge, rather. I guess let's push the spider. It doesn't, doesn't really do much, but whatever. Okay. I guess... You know what? Let's... Yeah, let's end turn. That's fine. Alright, kids are gonna run away. That's fine. He's probably going to open the lever. Yeah, so we've got company here. Great. Great, great, great. I could do 65% on the spider. It's not a bad use. Sweet. And bonus action. I could give bardic inspiration to somebody. Actually, I think I will. Who do I want to give it to? Maybe Lazelle, because she is such a heavy damage dealer for us. So, Bardic Inspiration. Although, actually, I'm going to hold off. You know why? Because the hat that I'm wearing means that when I give Bardic Inspiration to somebody, it heals them for a little bit of um, health. And so I would rather wait to give inspiration uh, until somebody's actually a bit wounded. So bonus action, I don't know if there's anything I need to do. Let's just check through these real quick. Yeah, no, I think we're okay. 
But the kids are running away, and they know that we're not going to kill a kid. Or I hope they know that we're not going to kill a kid. Which means the whole camp is going to be... <laughs> is going to be alerted to our presence. Alright, Warrior Plig. Oh my goodness. Alright, it might be time to start cracking some spells. What do we want to do here? Mirror image wouldn't be too bad. Channel divinity. What can I do with my channel divinity? Uh, oh yeah, the invoke duplicity. Uh, I only get it once a day though, which is the thing. And if we're going to have to fight our way out, then that is a problem. I think I'm going to wait. I'm not going to use it now. Uh, I'm just going to I'm just going to attack, I think. Yeah. Okay. Well, all that for not much. Um and I, uh, that's my turn. Yeah. Action search, huh? Whoa. That's quite a that's quite a trick. Warrior plague is down. Okay. What is this water barrel? You know, I'm going to do a level 1 magic missile again. So, I'm going to take a little bit of damage walking through here, right? Or maybe not. Okay, I'm going to do magic missile. One here. One on the warrior. And then one... Who's the next one to that I want to take down? Uh, probably this ward. So, breaking the water barrel means I doused myself. I wish the bear could have been doused, but I can't be helped. Um... And I think that's it. I always have Misty Step available if I need it, but it's fine. All right, Lazel, uh, you've got some heavy lifting to do, my friend. <laughs> uh, pushing attack. I mean, I guess. Astral Knowledge, no. Mage Hand, no. Disarming attack. Disarming attack would be interesting on the goblin here. Why don't we try that? That's a that's a first for us. Alright, we'll use our reaction. That didn't work. Action surge once a short rest. Well, let's hold off for now. Uh, spiritual weapon, just attack that guy. Nine damage, very good. And that's that. Oh, these guys are coming in as well. These archers. It's problematic. Alright, we should probably dish out some... Hmm. Hey. Vicious Mockery. Who am I most worried about? This guy's a level 3. That's what I'm, I'm thinking. Cutting words. Um, ooh. No, let's not react. I don't think that's important enough to react to. And that's it, I guess. Oh, really? You're going to go straight after my wizard? That's pretty rude. All right, Shadow Heart. Um,. I may need to do the duplicate. Uh, mirror image. Yeah, I hate I hate to have to use it here, but I think this is a, turning out to be a pretty tough fight. So, we're gonna do it. Uh, we'll put the mirror image 
right here. And um, I could do a healing word for Gale if I wanted to. No, I think I'll I'll, mm, I'll wait until he goes down. If he goes down. Oh, crit on me. That's kind of sucks. Uh, we'll repost. Oh, <laughs> he's out. It's crazy. All right, bear. Come on. Nice. 13 damage. And a heal as well. All right, I'm worried about this guy who's all up in my business. Uh, let's, let's switch it up. Let's try to break this concentration on... This Beastmaster. Damn. Okay. Uh, we could push him, maybe? Athletics failed. Alright. Well, you're tough. I'll give you that. Maybe spiritual weapon I can get an attack off? Concentration broken on Hunter's Mark. That's good. Okay. And attack there. Where's this guy going in the order? He's going pretty early. Hmm. What do I have? I can I can hit two of them with a with a thunder wave, which would knock them back. That wouldn't be a terrible idea. Just to kind of make sure that they can't. Um, they can't hit me. It's just so pricey knowing that we're going to have to to fight our way out of here, you know. Could do shocking grasp if I wanted to. Or topple, knock it prone. It's a deck save. Um Let's do this. I guess we're going to use our once a day misty step. Or not once a day, but our uh, one of our uh, spell slots for Misty Step. It's kind of what I'm thinking. Ooh, it's a level 2 spell slot. That sucks. Flaming spear Sphere would be cool too. Hmm. This is a tough, tough decision. See, the, the only thing that's giving me pause is and now I know the entire goblin camp is against us, so we're going to have to fight our way out of here, you know? We've got disadvantage here. 49% though. Let's just do it. Critical miss on top of everything else. Well, that's problematic. Thank goodness that missed. Uh, repost, yep. Oh, <laughs> Lazelle is seriously the MVP. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Uh, let's do let's do vicious mockery on this guy for sure. They failed the saving throw. Okay, that makes me feel a little bit better. Swiped on Gale and missed, but this archer. Uh, they're gonna attack the spiritual up, and I don't care really. It's whatever. All right, Shadow Heart. When is the bear going? The bear is probably going to take this guy down, so I don't care as much. So let's see, 55% Sacred Flame, 60%. Let's do that. Not react. Succeed on athletics. That's good. Uh, all right, we'll stay right there. Whoa, critical hit. Ensnaring strike on me. That's fine. Um, no, I, I don't really care if I'm ensnared because I'm not moving anywhere. I kick down the bear. Oh, no, that's not good. I really need this guy to go down. Um, wizard melee, maybe? 45%. Or 49%. Let's go with a 49%. Ignis. 
miss. Damn. Okay. I wonder, can I take a shot, a crossbow shot? Disadvantage. No, never mind. Um, I can actually stay within the threatened range of this warg and still get a hit off. I think that's what I'm going to do. Nice, Lazelle. Oh my goodness, she is just... I can't say enough good things. And... I could start going after these archers. I think we've got enough firepower right here that I might want to just fly. Um, can't actually fly very... Whoa. That was, that was a weird camera angle. I can't actually fly very far, surprisingly. So if I fly here... That's all of my movement, pretty much. So I wouldn't be able to get an attack off. Alright, let's 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 stay here. Let's just stay here in that case. Nice! 13 damage, hey, that's not nothing. And then we can- and then we can fly. Right? Can I at, le at least get up here? Oh, I didn't realize they'd get an opportunity attack. That's... Problematic now. Not sure if I can get up here. Oh! I saw a single pixel where I could potentially... fly here. Perfect. Okay. End turn. Ooh, come on, bear. Oh, they've got they've got plenty of points. That's fine. So I'm ensnared, which means I can't move and take 1d6 per turn. Removes when helped. Hmm. All right, I'm okay for now, and I've got healing potions. So why don't I chug a healing potion? And I will do Listen, Vicious Mockery on you that guy on the warg, which they failed. Good. Okay. I'm fine with that. All right. They're attacking my spiritual weapon. That's good. They're distracted. Sacred Flame, 60%. Short. And they saved. Cool. Well, let's start. Let's have her start coming up here. I think to get some uh, damage on these lovable larrikins over here. Ooh, I could use my repost for my reaction, but that would be my final superiority die, I think. And I'm gonna save it, so we'll hold off for now. What? Excuse me? I didn't realize that was a thing. Okay. <laughs> uh, Gail, can you put this guy down? 49%. Ooh. He is in a tough spot right now. Rave sickness, actually. 49%, 49%. 49%. Why do I have disadvantage right now? An enemy is close, has disadvantage. Oh, I see. Huh. This Misty Step is looking better and better. We go up here. And be like behind Penelope. Or I could just go here behind the bear. I'm just afraid I'm going to take an opportunity attack from the warg, which is why I'm not just running away. Um. Bonus action potion. Primary action. I think we'll just roll with disadvantage. Oh, with one health? Are you kidding me, bro? Alright. Let's... Yeah, I've got one superiority die. Let's just attack normally. Ten damage. Cool. And then shove this guy. I guess. Okay. Spiritual weapon. Come and attack this archer. Nine damage. Pretty good. 
Uh, okay. The bear saved. That's good. Let's take this guy down. Once and for all. Perfect. And I'm happy where I'm at. Alright, Shadow Heart. 12 HP and 12 HP doesn't really matter. Let's just go in. Sacred Flame? No, main, main weapon. We'll do this. Okay, cool. We'll keep doing that. Take a healing potion. Uh, don't react. Ensnaring strike on Gale, huh? Uh, no. No, we're gonna save up those. Nice. You go, bear. Alright, Gale. You are finally free to move about the cabin. <laughs> Firebolt on this one. They are down. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. And let's go here. Um, behind the bear. So we have a little bit of cover, perhaps. And turn. I wonder if I could have her come over here and then jump up here. Probably not, right? But what if I could, though? Let's try it. Let's try it. We're going to have to dash anyway. Uh, jump. Oh, I can't jump up here. Man, that would have been pretty cool, though, if I could just totally vault this... Uh, Oh, maybe? Actually? Hang on. Not enough space. I keep getting like a like a frame like a half of a frame there where it seems like I can do it real depending on where I put the mouse. Uh maybe not. Okay, okay, alright. I get the idea. We'll go the long way around. It would have been cool, though. You got to give me that. It's spiritual weapon. Let's just take this one down. Down for the count. Let's go and threaten them. Uh, do, I, do I have a shot on them? I don't. Oh, are they the last one? Oh, I think they're actually the last one. Uh, can I help myself? Is that a thing? Uh, let's see. Help. Oh, I can't target myself. And I'm... Oh, but I'm no longer ensnared because concentration is broken. Okay. Well, it doesn't really matter. I think what I'm going to do is get a get behind cover because Enough I prefer forward. not to be targeted by this archer. All right. Uh, get his... Close as you can. Sacred flame. Alright, that works. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Whoa! See that was that was pretty cool. You gotta give him. That that was the jump I was looking for. Firebolt. Oh, I'm not gonna be able to hit him from here. Uh, just run over here, I guess. Time to strike. I can't reach it. Oh, is the bear going to steal my, uh, kill? No, I refuse. Lazel, take him down. Miss. All right, great. Well, uh, spiritual weapon. How about you? Can you fly? Oh, I can fly here. And attack. Nice. Down for the counts. One for the ages. Lazel is inspired. One should cherish all of nature's bounty, but goblin guts are quite far down the list. You aided a bear without knowing if it would savage you. Oh, I knew who you were, to be fair. <laughs> a true friend of nature. Or perhaps a lunatic. Either way, I owe both. thanks. I am the druid Halson. Well... We have a lot to talk about, Halzen. Um, glad I could be of help. I've been to the Emerald Grove. It's in danger. I am aware. Yep. I foolishly left it vulnerable to this rabble. There's work to be done. Mm. 
That look in your eyes. I've seen it before. Are you feeling all right? What do you mean? <sighs> Oak father preserve you, child. You're infected, aren't you? Oh yeah, I kind of forgot the about that. Spawn. It's just my normal life now. But something's different. You're aware of the monster inside you. You don't bow to the absolute like the true souls do. How is this possible? Well, um... Yeah, I escaped from an illithid ship after being infected. Maybe the process was interrupted. I kind of wish it was my character that was talking to Hausen after the fact and not... Uh, Gail, but whatever. Perhaps. But I wouldn't want to place all my faith in blind luck. It's no coincidence that you found me here, I'll wager. You're after a cure for this parasite. I've been studying these parasites for a while now. Ever since I discovered these so-called true souls are infected with them, someone is using very powerful magic to modify these tadpoles. They're using them to exert control over the infected. I'm sorry to say, I can't undo that magic, which means I can't cure you. Oh, that's great. But that doesn't mean I can't help. I didn't find what I came here for, a way to remove the tadpoles. But I found the next best thing. I found out where they come from. That must be where these enchantments are placed on them. And it's where you'll find your cure. Hmm. So... Yeah, let's just start from the top. How have the tadpoles been created? I overheard that the cultists are sending all of their captives to Moonrise Towers. Innocents go in, true souls come out. Given that all of these true souls are infected, it has to be the source for this magic. If you want to find a cure, you must head there and discover how the tadpoles are being manipulated. Um... Yeah. Oh, we can bring him along. Yeah, why not? I wish I could, but there's still work I've yet to finish. Blood I've yet to spill. I've no right to ask more of you, but if you could help me, I'd be free to join your journey to Moonrise. I cannot allow these butchers to threaten my grove. The natural order must be protected. Brother, that is an easy sell for me. Um... There's no order, only chaos. That's chaos true. is welcome in doses. It helps keep balance. But this is too much. This is unnatural. Help me kill the leaders of this horde. Save my grove. Then I will help you. Three deaths could win us peace. The Drowm in Thara, the Hobgoblin Draw Ragslin, and that perversion of a priestess, Gut. They are the yeah. ones holding these parasites together. I thought you Remove might say them, that. And nature will cure itself. Uh, that's true. Having a shape-shifting bear druid at my side might make things easier. That's very fair. My thanks. If you prevail, I'll owe you the debt of a lifetime. Be warned. My presence could make things more difficult. I can only restrain my bear form so much. Oh. I won't be able to help but attack goblins. If I join you, we'll likely have to slaughter this entire place. I see. You may want to use discretion when approaching the goblin leaders. Okay, well, never mind then. <laughs> may Sylvanus guide your hand. Focus on the leaders. That's all it will take to restore the balance yeah, here. Yeah, I don't necessarily need or want to kill the entire village or camp. So what did what did Lazel do that, that I liked? Um, survive a fight in which you kill 10 or more enemies. Yeah, there were quite a few, weren't there? Like, some of them were kids that immediately just left anyway, so don't be too proud of me, but... Oh, really? Evidence chest? There's nothing in there. So I wonder if we were captured, if this is where we would be uh, taken and, and all of our stuff would be thrown in these boxes. I've seen it before in some other games, like Knights of the Old Republic. That's kind of what I'm thinking. Uh, there's a prison key over here, so I don't need to... Lockpick, I don't think. Yeah, I'll take that. 
Well, interesting. I didn't know that, um... I guess it makes sense. Like, I was a little bit bummed out that we immediately had to fight, start fighting the goblins as soon as we released Halzen. I feel like there should have been another option to... Um... There should have been another option to kind of deal with that situation differently, but... It makes more sense now that I know that he can't control the way he reacts around goblins. Or he says he can't. I guess you should take that with a grain of salt, huh? An acid vial. Oh, I can't get it, so... A mysterious hole. Everybody loves a mysterious hole. Decaying legs protrude Ew. from the hole. A failed escape, it seems. Investigate? Yeah. Okay. Definitely we'll take guidance on this one. DC5? Oh, okay. Well, just don't get a one. <laughs> Even the bare minimum will do it. Rolling a three. It seems the tunnel collapsed mid-dig and suffocated him. A crooked heart is embroidered on his left shoe. Hmm. Was that a quest for somebody that we were supposed to recognize? I guess let's, yeah, pull it out, see what we can see. The body comes loose, revealing a tunnel. Perhaps you can escape where he failed. I mean, I don't really need to, per se. I mean, I guess... Oh, boy. Let's see, does he have anything on him? I guess we can investigate that hole. Again, we don't... We don't really need to, uh, oh, let's take that. Grease powder, smoke powder bomb. Kind of careless of them to leave all that lying around, huh? Um, maybe we'll investigate the hole. As all good D&D &D players do, always investigate the hole. Uh, but first we want to loot the corpses. And then, I don't know. Like, Halzen's saying, well, if I come with you, you'll have to kill the whole camp. But I'm also like, didn't those kids run away and go get help? So won't we have to kill the entire camp anyway? Like, once we exit this area, isn't our cover effectively blown? That's what I'm thinking. Ooh, animal friendship. Level one enchantment spell. Interesting. And a bunch of potions of healing. Interesting, interesting. Okay. Okay. Uh, bones and skulls, don't need that. Uh, I'll send the stuff to camp, why not? Severed legs, severed torso, suspicious meat, ooh. Oh no, this is the guy that they said they were gonna kill and eat, wasn't it? This head, yeah. Uh, Bill or something was his name? That's kinda, that's gruesome. Alright, anything in the wargs, uh, area in here? Some bones. I'm holding out for maybe like some jewelry or something that uh, the wargs wouldn't want to hit. Okay. Hey, Worf. Warg Fang. Goblins undoing. Goblins have disadvantage on attack rolls against the wheeler. This is a dagger. Cool. I'll take that for sure. I wonder who I could give it to. Not many people use a dagger. Even a Starian as my rogue uh, is not much of a dagger wielder. I've honestly, I've, I've had him a charming little egg. Hang on, I gotta read this. Round and speckled, there's something appreciably cheerful about an egg. Even the world itself. Egg. How frolicsome. Absolutely delightful. Fire wine barrel. Uh, even a starion I've been using mostly as a ranged uh, type rogue. Oh, hello. Uh, line breaker boots adrenaline rush once per turn when you dash you gain wrath for two turns that sounds potentially good for um, for Lazel what does wrath mean again is that like a rage or let's see adrenaline courses through your veins you have a plus one bonus to damage with melee weapons yeah let's for sure send that to Lazel She's already such a beast, she doesn't even need it. Ooh, Warg Fang. Cool. Lots of good stuff. Gold, a cleaver, a spiked shield. We, we'll take the valuable stuff. Uh, I'll 
I'll take this gold. Thank you very much. I'll take that gold. Uh, another prison key, in case we missed it the first time. A great axe potentially could come in handy. Check out this back room here. Let's cast some light so we can see what's going on. Anything going on back here? Actually, not much going on. And then one more room to look at, and we'll probably be good to call it an episode. Man, what a, what an eventful episode. It's kind of a bottle episode, because it was almost entirely in this one room, right? Let's cast light in here. Oh. That's not what I was trying to do. There we go. Uh, what do we have here? Water barrel. Wooden barrel. I wonder if it's worth it to keep a water barrel with me. If there ever will be a, a situation in which I'm going to want to uh, douse something. I guess I do have the bottles of water, which are a little bit easier uh, on my equipment capacity. Anything else in here? Fire wine. Okay, I think that is actually it. So, wow, what an episode. I guess I next nothing. time we will leave this uh, area and see <laughs> what kind of trouble we're in outside of this room. Which, since the kids are gone, I expect is lots of trouble. But, can't be helped. We were here to rescue Hausen and rescue him. We did. So, thanks so much for watching. This was a really fun episode and hope you enjoyed it as well. And I'll see you in the next one. Farewell for now.